Hello everyone, my name is Luchara, and this is my time at Sandrock, episode 6, day 6. Today, I think my priority is going to be, I'd like to get my tools upgraded. I need more, uh, I need more bronze for that though. So I'm going to have to go dig up some copper, and I think I'm going to have to find some tin as well. So I think I'm going to have to clear some floors in the abandoned ruins. Uh, the question is, do I want to just strictly focus on that? Oh, what happened to the stage? Look at everybody coming together to rebuild after the sandstorm. Warms my heart. Sand everywhere. My goodness. Kaya, are you okay? I am. Are you okay? The sandstorm last night was terrifying. I didn't sleep a wink. How are you holding up? I want to go back to Highwood. That thought crossed my mind as well. We never had any truly awful weather in Tall Sky. But we're here now, so we better get used to it. Exactly. Anyway, I was walking around town earlier, looking at the damage, and ran into Matilda. She wants us to go check out that stage outside of the Blue Moon right now. So I came to get you. Okay. She's waiting. Let's go. Well, um, <laughs> before I go... Yeah, I can't do any bronze. Okay, so I need tin. I need to get some tin ore. And, okay, so those both have bots queued up. Alright, let's go. I'm right behind you, Mion. <laughs> kind of. Sort of. Almost. In a way, I'm right behind her. Just, you know. There we go. See? Right behind her. <laughs> it's okay, Owen. It's okay. We're gonna repair it. It's okay. I know. He's devastated. He's devastated. We'll we'll fix it though. At least no one was hurt. We can always rebuild. Indeed. Say, speak of the devil. If it isn't our resident builders here to save the day. That's us. We are in a real jam here. We wanted to do a stage performance for Mason's going away ceremony, but now the plan's in shambles. Would you two be dears and find a way to fix this thing up? Yeah, I mean, Mason really wants to leave. If he can't leave till we fix this, then we better fix it. I don't doubt you'll be up to your eyeballs and other commissions. But whenever the stage is fixed, we can reschedule that ceremony. So I'm afraid I must insist on an official town request of the highest priority. Well then, highest priority. Top of the list. Can you draw up a new design? Yeah, Heidi. I was sort of expecting the stage to collapse one of these days. So I already designed a new one. Here's the diagram, builders. Oh, All right. My, that's great. Why don't you builders decide on which part you want to do? Ooh, ooh, can I do the part that doesn't use a bunch of wood? You pick first. I'm fine with either. Backdrop or support? Um, I don't know. I'm going to assume they're both going to use a lot of wood. Let's go All with the right, support. Let me know how it goes. Good luck and thanks again. By the way, if you guys need it, you can go ahead and salvage this here stage. Stagey would have wanted it that way. You named your stage Stagey. All right. I did have respect for you, Owen, but I'm not sure if I do anymore. <laughs> All right. Oh, I need a better tool. Well... All right, so yeah, the game's telling me to upgrade my tools, I guess. <laughs> Howdy. Hey there, Builder. It looks like you survived your first sandstorm. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, the storm really did a number on my saloon, though. In addition to the stage, I don't suppose you noticed. There's something missing around here. Something very essential. Moon sign? Bingo. The sand rock skyline just isn't the same without it. Oh, I'm still busy patching up everything here, so I was hoping you could find it for me and bring it back. Or if it's really gone, gone, make a new one for me. Let's not give up on it just yet. I agree. Sandstorm was mostly blown in the direction of the Yakmel Ranch. Do you think you can help me find it? I can do it. Great. When you go out in that direction, watch for the rocket roosters. Not a friendly bunch. I'd consider them armed, er, winged, and dangerous. Indeed. Anyway, if you find it, please install it for me as well. My, my saloon's not just the same without it. I agree. It isn't. Goes way up there. All right. Let's get a commission. Got to do my daily commission. 
And then, oh, God, so many things to do. So I... if you'll just move a few decimeters to your left, I think you'll find the pathway to the commission board to have become quite clear, allowing a way for me to snag a commission. Ha, <laughs> no deal. You can't fool me with your mind games, man. Okay, I give up. Look at yourself. How long has it been since you finished that big elevator thing? And you're already back in here. At it again. That's what we do. We build. Elsie, come on. You need to admit that you have a problem, Mian. You're a workaholic. No one goes well, I guess I am too, then. I mean, I didn't have anything going on today. What else would I do if I didn't pick up a commission? Exactly. I understand, Mian. I understand. A whole heck of a lot else. I'm going to tell you. I got to take this hat off. <laughs> one of you. All right, that's it. This is an intervention. I'm taking the two of you out to do something fun. No commissions allowed. But, but, I don't like this. I guess it wouldn't kill me to take one day off. And I am pretty tired. But, but. Hey there. I guess we're going somewhere. Want to join us? I guess. Thanks joining us. As I was saying, what you two need is to relax. And what better way to relax than a rigorous and debilitating day of mountain climbing and yakmel wrangling? That doesn't sound like a day off. my toe this morning better stay out the mountains for today <laughs> so why don't we just stop into the golden goose gaming center for a little bit instead i like the way you think me on well, huh G games oh but that's kid stuff cool mature adult tap folk like us spend our leisure time running free on the wild frontier and games 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 I guess if y'all really want to, we can go to the game center. But I'm not playing any y'all's kid games, all right? I'm just there to keep you company and make sure you don't relapse. Oh, I'm going to relapse. I'm going to be back in here like as soon as we're done playing games. Now let's hurry on over. We'll see you there. I can't go right now? No, I'll go yeah. with them. It's like a triple date. I am going to get a commission first, though. Rubber shell, stone slate, grinding saws. Ooh, processor. Processor's worth a lot. We just made one. I forget. You know what? I'm going to do the processor. I might regret this. There's a very real chance I regret this. <laughs> That's okay. All right. Game center. I'll go to the game center for a couple hours, I guess. I don't like it, though. Yeah, I got to salvage that. I just don't. I just need a better tool. I think the game center's up here. <laughs> Pretty sure. It's over here. There's the museum. Uh, is it over here? Yeah, right here. Hey, we were just about to go in. Ready to get your game on? Let's do it. Well, here we are. Same old game center. Yawn. Y'all can pick a game to play. I'll watch. Okay. I think I've seen folks on these games before. On some, two people can play at the same time. I guess the point is to see who the better gamer is. Whew, I'm falling asleep listening to myself explain this. Guess it runs in the family. Hey, you're the one who wanted to do something, Elsie. Don't mind her. Like, how about whack a mole? Let's try that one first. Whack a mole works for me. Got one. You even gonna move me on? Or is it just my turn right now? Oh, she got that one. Oh, they're all over the place. Hey, it's mine. Ah. Did I get it? I got it. I think I'm the winner. Ah, I missed. I only missed once. Do not miss twice. Oh, what it says use skill? What's skill? I don't appear to have a skill. Oh, you can do a spin to win. Sorry, Mion. I got spinning and winning to do. I missed that one. No, oh, she got one. I let her get one. How long does this last? Oh, 20 more seconds. Okay. How long before I can use my skill again? Um, You know what would help, Looch? If you didn't hit one that was already gone down. 10 seconds? 
Ish. All right, you can have that one. I'll take these two. Yeah. No, oh, another stopwatch, dude. Oh, she got her spin to win. Well, good for you, Mion. I think I win. Oh, yeah, smoked her. Double. I am the mole whacking king. Well, you got to stand around less and move more. That was fun. Basically. I played that one by myself, but it's even more fun with two people. Absolutely. And where did Elsie go? Could she have gone inside? Let's check. She couldn't even stay long enough to watch one single game. Come on now, Elsie. Get better. Like, no patience. Other than that, she's an addict and she just doesn't want to admit it. <laughs> Yeehaw! Get wrecked, yo, scrub! What the? I lost? Let's go get you, dumb machine! Okay, yeah, so she's just an addict and she doesn't want to admit it. L, I thought you didn't want to play. Huh? What? Neon? Fuck off! Y'all are bad luck! Mm. I disagree. Oh my god, she is a game. She is an addict. She spent all her money. Neon, how come you never told me how great games are? My heart's pounding. My mind is racing. I've never felt so alive. I, I know, right? Dang. All this pro gaming has worked me up an appetite. Onward, posse. Let's head on over to the blue moon to rustle up some grub. Yeah, come on. Works for me. Although I haven't spent any stamina yet today. Should I do, should I spend a little stamina right quick? Just so that, I don't know, like, are we actually eating food? I'm not sure. Mm, probably not. Well, we might be. I don't know, what's the quickest source of spending stamina? I guess I could attack some of those fire ant thingamabobs. Burgess has a quest. You're going to have to wait, Burgess. Some wooden scrap here. And then we'll head to the blue moon. Some more wooden scrap up there. Yeah, I don't know. This game is really good at, you know, throwing distractions at you, distractions at you right? I got so much stuff I need to do in games like, oh, how about you do something that's completely <laughs> not what you were planning to do today? But you don't want to be, like, rude and say no when people invite you to go play games. Right? Like, anyway, all right. Let's go see if the ladies are waiting for me or if they, if they gave up and just started eating. We will find out. I'm assuming they probably waited for me. They did. I'm here. I really got to take this ridiculous hat off. It does kind of add something. But don't just go and order all the most expensive stuff on the menu. I only work part time for my parents. I thought you were just out of money. I thought you spent it all on games. Y'all, hold tight. While you're ordering, I'm gonna go grab a surprise. Don't worry about me. I'll be right back. You better be. Huh? I wonder what on earth she could be planning. Oh well, let's eat. I agree. Oh, I never know what to eat. There's so many choices. Uh, why don't you decide? Okay. All right, so we'll do the special. That's 33. And then we'll just have uh, some steamed sandfish. That should fill me up, right? Is this one of my two meals for the day, though? Oh, that's what she's eating. Oh, well, I thought Elsie was paying for it. I hope y'all left room in your stomachs for some surprise. Don't be shy. Go ahead and open it up. Okay. You really had a gift all ready for us? You shouldn't have. Yeah, the hat really adds to the cutscene for sure. Will you do the honors? I will. Ooh. Okay, it's like that, is it? I see. You got you got us. Y'all should have seen the look on y'all's faces. You were all like, what? I told you I was gonna surprise you. Was I fibbing? No. I y'all to come up with a more interesting gift to give me. I'll be waiting for you. I'm gonna go give you a 
pile of poop. Well, until then, I bid y'all adieu. That was fun. Until we meet again. See ya. Bye. Hey, uh, what did you think of Elsie's surprise? Did it frighten you? Yes. So it's not just me. Elsie's always pulling these pranks on me. Sometimes I'm afraid to even leave my workshop. I understand. Well, it was nice to get out today anyway. If you get time, you should take your other friends out too. Maybe warm them up with a few gifts if they don't accept your invitation at first. Yeah, I get it. Grease the wheels with some gifts. I think Understood. I most people to be more relaxing around. Elsie can be a bit lively. Ah, she's got a little bit too much of her father in her. I better get back to the workshop. Catch you later. It was fun today. All right, so it's only 10 o'clock, so I didn't waste too much time. Well, I shouldn't say it's not a waste of time. I didn't spend too much time doing this stuff. All right. Um, chance to gain double workshop knowledge from uh, items made from machines or at your work table. Increased by 10%. Oh, there's a lot of things here. Better chance to get high quality items. Better chance to get high quality items. Yeah, let's do that from the work table and machines. Sure. I don't know what high quality items really do. <laughs> But, uh, yeah. All right. So, we don't want to eat right yet because my stamina is basically full. It is only 10 o'clock, right? So, we, it's not like we've really... We haven't really wasted any time. That was a fine use of my time, right? Got to make some friends. And it's kind of like a tutorial, right? It's showing me some of the things you can do in the game. What's old Fang saying here? I should probably check my... Sh machines though as I walk by right Bang. Who's that? Who's that? Ah. Bang. the new builder oh he actually talks Bang. Who's that? Who's that? the new builder okay good I'm glad we established that part of the conversation <laughs> I mean I could just pick up the one that I have to do that commission Right? Like, if I really wanted to, that would work, technically. All right, let's recycle this wood scrap. Um, 20 seconds for that. All right, so let's see what old Burgess has in store for me here. Good day to you, Builder. I was just looking for you. Oh, yeah, you want to charge me with a crime? Probably. I came by to ask you to fill out a survey. It's something the church gives to all newcomers. Very standard procedure. Care to take a moment to fill it out? I guess so. First question. How often do you follow the rules? Um, well, I'm just going to say always because, you know, this guy seems to be a bit of a stickler for the rules. Mm -hmm, I see. What are your opinions on bandits? They're the worst. Mm -hmm, I see. And finally, what are your feelings towards water wasting? Oh, Never man. waste water. Let me just run the numbers here and uh, Did I win? Did I get a hundred percent? I have a feeling you're going Ooh, yeah. to right in here plus ten percent relationship. Type is do -gooder. Yeah, just like you there, Dudley Do Right. Since that's the case. I'm sure you'll take no issue in helping out the church a bit. Right now. Oh, did I just get tricked into doing a quest? So the short of it is there's some sand on the plants and flowers in our temple garden. If you could go clean that up for us, that'd be great. Great. I'll see what I can do. Thanks in advance. And may the light follow you always. Oh, and you. The way, you'll need a feather duster to clean up the plants. You do have a feather duster, don't you? They're all the rage these days. Not quite yet, but I'm working on it. It's on my giant list of things to do. Hey, Builder, uh feels super weird calling you that. I think I'm just going to stick with Luchara. Your ma said you should arrive by now, but it's so weird my mailbox is still completely empty, huh? I was, was I wrong to have expectations? I'm not forgiving you. Who Who is this person? So I know that you're currently crippled with grief over the abandonment of your bestest friend, apparently my best friend, but I hope you've managed to overcome that and settle in a little in Sandrock. In my head, it's all howdies and guns, but I reckon it's probably much, much more boring than that. I gotta admit, though, it does feel a bit weird without you here. I even went to your house last night. I feel like such doofus. Remember when we used to play together? You used to get into all sorts of trouble. Ha! Over in Sand Rock, you got your sand bandits. We should have called ourselves the air pirates. Speaking of, there's no one to go gliding with me anymore. They banned cold flying recently over health and safety concerns, but that never stopped us before. So when you come and visit, which you have to, you'd be able to sneak out and do it, I bet. 
Hope you managed to push through your missing me to be able to make some friends. Not best friends, mind. I'm watching you. How are the people there? All yak boys, right? Ah, ha, ha. I remember the impression you did of sand rockers before you went. Hilarious, but I hope it's not like that. Those sand bandits sound dangerous. You've got to be careful, okay? I mean, I'm not worried about you or anything. You still owe me 30 goals. Oh my god, how long is this letter? <laughs> my studies have been going really well, by the way. Dr. Guo told me a real knack for planting. I told you so. Maybe I should try and be independent like you. I reckon I could go out somewhere in those wild wastes and become a real botanist. I heard they got some... They got someone over in San Rocky studying how to grow plants in extreme conditions. I know you think that's super boring, but it's actually really cool. I've always told you how similar planting and building is, but I swear, you never listen to me. Maybe someday you can show me those legendary desert flowers. Speaking of which, I need to go and take care of my flowers. Remember that orchid I planted before you left? Well, when you come visit, you'll be able to see how much it's grown. It'll be a great reminder for how long you've abandoned me. I'm joking. I miss you. Um, I miss you too? Yeah, I miss you too. That works. Replied. Delete. And yeah, hopefully this is not as long. <laughs> uh, weekend has arrived. Guild inspections. All right, I'm not going to read this whole thing. So this is something that you do on the weekends at the, um, the guild hall. It's the same as it was in my time at Porsche. Um, but you need to be two-star rated for that, which I don't think I am. So yeah, we're not going to worry about it just yet. All right, copper scrap. Done. So let's get some... Let's just do this one rubber scrap. And then... Okay, so let's hit the scrapyard. Should I hit the scrapyard? You know what? I'm not going to hit the scrapyard. I'm just going right into the mines. Or the, the abandoned ruins, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to do this wood scrap. Scrapyard, I mean, there's lots of good stuff, but it uses so much stamina, right? Maybe at the end of the day, I can come up and try to clear this. Oh, what's happening here? Is that fireworks? Hey there. Ready to do some diving? The show must go on, but it sure isn't going anywhere until the two of us get what we need to build that stage. Indeed. Say, if you don't mind me asking, how deep have you dived into the abandoned ruins? Deep. <laughs> yeah, you know. The abandoned ruins isn't just a single layer. If you follow your scanner, you can find deeper areas within the ruins. That's where all the good stuff is, since they're less disturbed by other divers. Okay, all this, it's like, well, I feel like I'm still in the tutorial. Now is that we're going to have to go pretty deep for this commission. Hope you brought some snacks. <laughs> Maybe see you inside? Later. All right. I just realized my audio balance was a bit off. My in-game volume was a bit low. I'm hoping you can still hear the people. I just turned it up, so it should be better now. But anyway. Yeah, I'm not replaying the whole day now. <laughs> we've come we've come too far. Alright, so starting at level two. And like I said, hopefully I can get far enough to get tin. That way I can make some copper. And that way I can hopefully upgrade my tools. I don't need any copper ore, so let's just. How do I get out of here? Probably down here. Um, what is this? I need a better tool, don't I? Yeah, yeah, need a better tool, need a better tool. All right, so scanner. The exit is right here. Uh, do I, like, it's like the copper's right here. I feel like I should probably get it, but I have a ton of copper. Like, I don't need copper. Right? So you know what? We're just gonna go to the next area here. I have no idea how deep I gotta get for tin. So yeah, like I said, prioritization is definitely just gonna be on getting to the next area. All right, so let's see if we can trigger these, get out of the way, I'll blow up, clear some stuff for me. Looks like the exit's down here. Uh, yeah, well, that's easier than digging all the way through. What is this? Can I salvage this? No. Yeah, the entrance, or the exit is through here. Three meters. Trap right before. <laughs> 
Oh my god, it's, we're still not out of the level. Right below me. All right, apparently you just fall into the abyss. <laughs> All right, next level. Vending machine. Oh, they're so expensive. Oh, I don't have enough money for that right now. Oh, yeah, there we go. Tin. All right, so didn't have to go that far to find tin. So let's gather all the tin that we can. Yeah, how much is it around? There's a bit of it around. I mean, I'm assuming as I, if I stay on this level and just dig everything, there'll be tin around. But I'm almost out of stamina, so I will have to go back soon-ish. All right, um, down over here, there's a doorway to another area that probably has a bunch of tin in it. There we go. What is a fancy deck, dock? Um, I'm not seeing any tin, no, no, never mind. I take that back, there is tin. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I probably should have already upgraded my tools. Like the game kind of like, the game's like, oh, you don't have your tools upgraded yet? You're a slacker. You can't do this. You can't do that. Right? To the upgrader tools. All right. Uh, I'm getting low on stamina, but I'm just going to keep going. Hopefully find a little more tin here. I did get a couple data disks as well today, which is good. I need data disks always. I do have a little bit of food on me I can eat here. Since I'm so low on... Uh, energy. So it says I gotta go down further, but... Level up. Ooh, level 10. Didn't I have something that I couldn't wear to level level 10? Can I get through here? How about now? There we go. Oh, that gave me a little bit of stamina to level and up it, which is nice. That's that's convenient. Alright, so we'll get this tin and then we're, then we're out of here. A little more tin right here. This is probably more tin than I need, honestly. All right, perfect. Exit. Um, no, it's not a tab. Uh, close exit. Leave ruins. Do I want to? Eh, I was like, do I want to wait and clear this floor? No, it's fine. Like I said, I can come back later and clear further and wait for the elevator to spawn in yeah I'm not sure why the elevator takes so long to spawn in but it does <laughs> yeah, is there robots down there uh, you know what we're not going to mess with the robots right now I think later we mess with the robots she's going to let me in for free if I want but I don't need that right now all right, so we got to get uh, got to get copper coming, and then I got to see okay, what else do I need for the better tools? Make sure we get that going. Yeah, let's do the stone scrap, I guess. Lack of anything better. Furnace, um, copper, no bronze. We can only do ten at a time. There we go. And bronze bars. Should I... You know what? I would like to make another furnace if possible. Uh, do I have everything I need? I'll make two stone troughs, probably. Which is not hard. At all. There we go. And we should be able to make that. Ooh. Of course, the more machines I add, though more water I'm going to be burning through. Probably going to be an issue at some point. Well, it's definitely going to be an issue at some point. How's my water tank? It's down to 17%. I'm going to have to go buy a bit of water, I think. Um, from old Burgess. And once again, I'm hitting the wrong button to bring up my inventory. It's B. Loot, it's B. 
Remember that. It's B to bring up your inventory in this game. Like, that shouldn't be that hard to figure out. But apparently it is. Alright, so we've got 10 bronze bars coming there as well. Alright, so we got the bronze coming. What else do I need for better tools? Ooh, let's get my feather duster while I'm here. Okay. So I got a feather duster. Bronze axe. We need copper screws. We need a sharpening stone. Pick hammer, same. Copper screws, sharpening stone. Copper screws I can do right now um, at the other machine. I forget how many. I don't have that many copper bars, actually. Yeah, that's... Oh, wait. And... Fuel. That's running, okay, but that's another thing that's using water. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go buy some water. But, we'll make sure to stop by the saloon. Get some stamina. What's up, Jensen? Mm -hmm. Ever cleaned out... Yeah, ever cleaned sand out of an engine with a toothbrush? Oh, the things I do for love. Indeed. Mm -hmm. Might surprise you, but I love trains and machines. I keep a lot of models at home. My hobby. Come by and take a look sometime. I will. Catch you later. All right, so I got my feather duster out. Let's eat on the way. Cram a couple of meals into me. I'll find a way to spend this stamina. Believe me. Hey there. I mean, the scrap yard's untouched so far, uh... right? Any luck finding the sign? I have not even looked yet. Hope we find it soon before it gets buried by the sand. Um, so I go right, look for that. Catch you next time. God, so many things to do. All right, so special and some stewed beef and a little drinky poo. There we go. How much money do I even have? All right, so I got to buy two of those things that I need for my whatchamacallit as well. That's right, my whatchamacallit um, for the tools. I should do that while I'm close, I guess, right? Because it's just around the corner at the blacksmith. Time of day is it? 6.30. Alright, now I got some time. Oh, right here. So we need two of these. I do not have enough. I don't have enough money. Alright, um... God, I gotta buy water too. Alright, let's go see if we can find the moon sign. Right here. Right there. I mean, it shows you, it shows you exactly where it is. It's not like it's a that challenging of a quest and that's okay i don't think it's meant to be challenging i will probably have to kill a rocket rooster or two here he did warn me about them they're frightened I'm glad i made this spear because <laughs> it hits way harder than my punches do <laughs> Um, can I hit this guy? Why was I missing all of a sudden? Alright, so we still got... How am I doing for health? All kinds of health left. No worries. No worries. I actually, I'm not sure I have to even kill these guys. They seem to... Ooh, this is a cockadoodle doom. He's special. I think it drops something different too, right? Alright, so we got a lot of stuff. And we got the sign. Can I carry it? Seems awfully big. What's up here? Throwing rock? We really need throwing rocks. Oh, we got some scrap over here. Some copper scrap specifically. Um, do we have time for fish? No, we don't have time for fishing. So I'm hoping we get quests for this sign. <laughs> or get money for turning in this quest for this sign. Um, if not, well, then too bad for me, I guess. I probably have some stuff I could sell. Ooh, how close am I? Wait, I do have a commission. Which, what is the commission for again? Uh, mission. Task to accept and seen the mission list. There are a few different types of quests. You can switch tabs to see what you have of each. Select the task and look on the right to see more details about the task. You can see how much time you have to complete it, what's, what the rewards are, and more. Being tasked with rewarding relationship points, goals, works off reputation, experience points, and all kinds of items. 
This icon shows that the task is tracked. You can track two tasks at a time. If you track a task, key info will be visible from your main UI. Check your variable missions to see which tasks are out there, waiting for you to pick them up. Mission. Um, processor. All right. Uh, can I make a processor? Processor. Copper bars, old parts, grinding saws, bricks. Can try. Got the old parts. Got the bricks. Do not have the grinding saws. Need three grinding saws. Got that. Okay. And... Okay. Good. Good, good, good. So we can just finish this commission. That I'm pretty sure it's worth quite a bit of money, if I remember correctly. Okay, that's good. I feel much better about everything all of a sudden. For our dear departing but I do have concerns about... Uh, my water being low. Probably I can afford to get one of the things to upgrade my tool, but not two. What are you saying, Arvio? Hi there. Mm -hmm. Sandstorms means lots of work for builders like you. Once things settle down, when I stop in my store and ward yourself for a job well done, I might just do that. See ya. There's Grace. What are you, what are you saying, Grace? Hello. Hmm. If you don't own any property, it can't get damaged by sandstorms. This is one of the many benefits of being an intern. Indeed. So long, partner. All right, where's Owen? There's Owen. He's telling a story right now. Found Hello. your sign. Uh, Any luck finding the sign? Hope we find it soon before it gets buried by the sand. Hey, see you um, around. Oh, we got to install it first. Um, probably talk to some of Hi. these people. Hmm? Is it a coincidence that the sandstorms seem to be getting worse? In any case, it surely seems like a bad omen to me. Catch you later. Hmm. That sandstorm was wicked fierce. Near scared the life out of, out of our pebbles. Took them crazy long to fall asleep. Now you gotta work hard there, Bilda. A lot of stuff gotta be fixed up now, huh? Indeed. Seeing ya. Most of you have heard of the Geeglers. Oh. Some of you may have even seen a few up close. There's another mutant species out there. Though, that not everyone knows about. In fact, not much is known about them at all. Some say they're half-human, half-mole. Others say they're half-mole, half-human. I tend to believe the answer lies somewhere in the middle. Aren't those the same thing? I'm just saying. I'm going to say it. Those seem like the same thing to me. In any case, it's rumored that these talking animals all came from the same place. Some kind of old-world laboratory where they used to do experiments on animals. Well, that sounds pleasant. Kind of unfair that we have to suffer the consequences of actions taken by people before us, huh? Welcome to real life. All right, uh, justice. Howdy. <sighs> Man, I hate sandstorms. Hey, get back, everybody. I haven't talked to you all yet. If someone just build a giant fan, they can blow the next one away. I mean, just think about it. So long, Bob. Hey, I haven't talked to all of you yet. Hello? Uh-huh. Oh, look at you, poor thing. You've got more commissions than you can count, don't you? Kinda. Maybe I should go get little Hugo to help you out. He's been spending a lot of time on his behind lately. Slacker. See ya. All right, so we got to install the sign. Where did oh man, everybody took off quick. <laughs> um, well, I got to get up top. Probably got to go around for that. Or wait, or is it right here? All right, there we go. Sign is done. <laughs> this is great. It's a whole tell again. Ha ha. Thanks a million. Oh, that was bad. Oh, that was a bad joke. All right. 120 bucks. So that means we have enough at least for one. Oh, no, it's closed. All right. So tomorrow, tomorrow I'm upgrading tools. All right. So. <laughs> uh, all right. So who is commission? Chi. Uh, am I going to be able to turn this in today? Oh man, it's late. You know what? I gotta go spend. I have all this stamina to spend. I can turn that in tomorrow. It's, um. Man, uh, you know what? I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna turn time back down. <laughs> I'd like to actually be able to spend this stamina. I spent a lot of money on the stamina. I'd like to actually spend it, right? <laughs> Preferably. I might as well spend it getting scrap. Man, today felt 
both long and short at the same time, if that makes any sense. Like I realized this video was like 40 minutes long right about now, but I also feel like, like it felt like it was just four in the afternoon, like not long ago. Yes, tomorrow I will be upgrading at least one tool, possibly two. That remains to be seen. Definitely some. All right, got some more drags, got some XP, data disks. All right, we're out of stamina. That's fine, because it's 1120. <laughs> so we'll check our machines, and then we'll go to bed. And yeah, I guess a somewhat... Whoa, what's going on there? Oh, we got a copper stick. This flew out of the sky to me. <laughs> All right, recycler. We got copper scrap. Put all that in there. And then over here, we got uh, a bunch of stuff. I think it was stone scrap. All right, so let's do mechanical scrap. Beautiful. All right, we got bronze bars working overnight. Got some copper screws coming. And it's time to go to bed. Yeah, get at least one, if not two, tools upgraded tomorrow, which will be good. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Consider supporting me on Patreon. Links in the description down below to that. Shout out to my patrons. Uh, I could not do this without them. Most importantly, though, folks, be good to each other. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one.